Hello guys, uh, welcome back uh, to my channel for another unboxing video and uh, to show you guys uh, what uh, I bought uh, recently. Um, so I decided to do uh, this video today uh, because um, I managed to, to buy a lot of games uh, the last few weeks so it was a good opportunity to show you uh, which games uh, I bought for my collection. Uh, I also bought some uh, pop figures. Uh, if you can see here, uh, yeah, here's my TV. Uh, some uh, uh, pop figures collection that uh, I have, uh, but uh, I never uh, saw it before on uh, my channel. Uh, but today I, I also bought some uh, new pop figures, so uh, I would like to show you these guys. Uh, let's start from uh, the console first that I found. Um, here is the console. It's um, the N64, um, the orange uh, transparent color, as you can see. Um, I think that uh, it's not so rare, but uh, at least it's not like the transparent blue or the um, black that uh, are easily, easier to find uh, out in the market. So I found uh, this and the controller as well. As you can see here, yes, it's uh, it was really nice uh, for my collection because I only have uh, the official uh, black color so it was uh, a good opportunity because it was in a very good price only uh, 35 euros so I thought it was uh, a good addition to my collection so let's proceed to the next one the next things that I bought are some GameCube games. First of all, it's uh, Prince of Persia, The Sons of Time, complete, as you can see, with uh, the manual and uh, the disc in very good condition. The second game is uh, Tom Clancy's Splinter Cell, the first game. Again complete with the manual and the disc in no scratch at all. The third game is uh, the second Splinter Cell uh, video game which is the Pandora Tomorrow. Again for the GameCube, complete. I was really happy because I found all these uh, GameCube games uh, in uh, an almost perfect condition. The discs are untouched. The third game, it's it isn't so easy to find out there, is the beautiful Joy from Capcom, again for the GameCube, complete. I never played this game before, so I would like to try it. This game, guys, the internal darkness, I was looking for it everywhere. It wasn't so easy for me to find. Actually, I found uh, two times, but I missed it because it wasn't complete and I was looking for a complete uh, edition and uh, finally I found it complete, so it was a perfect time to buy it. I never played it uh, on its time in 2002, so I have the opportunity to play it now. I'm so happy for this. And the last game which is also not so easy to find out there, is the WarioWare Mega Party game for the GameCube. Again, complete.
really happy to find this as well. So, N64, GameCube games. Let's uh, see the next games. This is the next one. It's the Pucci and Yoshi's uh, Woolies World for the 3DS, the collector edition, uh, which includes the Amiibo, Pucci Amiibo. Uh, I know this is not a new release. Actually, it uh, was released uh, last year, but um, I thought that it was um, expensive for me to buy it because it was like 60 euros and uh, I found it uh, in a very very good price only 25 euros so uh, I was waiting actually for a price drop and I found uh, the best time to buy it let's open it here is the game And here is the amiibo. Yarn Pucci here, yes. Very nice. I will not open the amiibo because as you know I, I keep them sealed. So I will put it inside again. I will only open the game. Here is the game. I miss uh, the 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 um, Yoshi's uh, Woolly World for the Wii U, but it's still expensive to buy it. So I will wait for a price drop. Here's the game. Next stop, uh, let's see, first I will show you, I will show you the, the pop figures, guys, it's from the Kingdom Hearts um, collection, and this is the Shadow Heartless, I also keep um, the pop figures inside the boxes, uh, I like to keep them sealed as well as the amiibos the next pop figure is uh, Pete actually all the, uh, the pop figures that I bought it's from the Kingdom Hearts collection this is a double amiibo it's uh, the Chip and Dale from Kingdom Hearts. It's a really cool amiibo. And the last one is Mickey from Kingdom Hearts. So I, I only miss uh, Donald actually. I have the um, Goofy and uh, I miss only Donald. I have also Sora but this is from, it's from the same uh, collection, Kingdom Hearts, but it's um, another, let's say, sub-collection of uh, this uh, kind of series. So let's continue with uh, this game. It's uh, Final Fantasy IV, and uh, this is the um, USA, US uh, edition, actually. Uh, it's sealed. Uh, I found it also in a very good price. Um, 30 euros I think yeah but um, I, I decided not to open it because um, it's really hard to find the, um, this uh, game in Europe and uh, it's also hard to find uh, Final Fantasy 4 
uh, European edition as well. So um, I decided to buy the American edition. Actually, you can play all the um, the Nintendo 2D, uh, the Nintendo DS uh, version uh, game cartridges in the European uh, DS or 3DS. Uh, it's not region lock. So I found this as well. So I decided to buy it. I have Final Fantasy 3, so I missed only Final Fantasy 4. And let's uh, see the last games, which is three games for Nintendo Switch. First is Rocket League. Yeah, I don't have the, um, the cartridge because I already put it to um, the game, uh, the Nintendo Switch uh, game case. But this is the first game that I bought. The second game, which is sealed, it's a Resident Evil uh, Revelation collection and is a, a US import um, game because uh, here in Europe we don't have it uh, in a physical uh, edition. We have it only, um, you can only download it, so I prefer to have it uh, in physical copies, all my games. So I decided to import this game from US to have it complete. So let's see. Yeah. It's um this is the the game cartridge. It has the the first game, uh Resident Evil Revelation 1. And the second one is here to download it uh, to your Nintendo Switch. So I'm so happy to find this as well. The code is behind here. And last game for today. I bought it uh, yesterday and it's uh, the new game for Nintendo Switch and uh, it's Mario Tennis Aces. Let's proceed to the unboxing. You can see here some. Uh, um, it's like a, a sort manual that you they show you how to play the game, which buttons you can use, and here is the, the card it's itself. Nice. So that's all for today's guys. I hope uh, you like the video. Uh, give a thumb up and uh, subscribe to my channel for uh, more video like this in the future. Bye for now.